Hey guys, uh, thanks for coming. As usual, uh, tough weekend for us this past weekend. Uh, started out at Alabama, um, lost that match 4-1. Started the game pretty well. Um, scored a good goal. Mary Kate McGuire had a good goal. Uh, and then we gave up a kind of uncharacteristic goal off a corner. And, uh, and a little bit of the floodgates open, I think. Um, as I said to the team after, we tried to change our shape a little bit and um, make some tactical adjustments that just didn't work. So kind of took responsibility for that one. From a coaching standpoint, we got it kind of wrong. Then um, came back last yesterday afternoon to play Texas A&M. Um, lost that match 2-1. Really heartbreaking loss, honestly. Um, they went ahead. We played well in the first half. I thought did a lot of things we wanted to do, didn't get a goal. But we're, we're certainly a, a very even match at the worst. Came out in the second half, maybe didn't play great to start the half. They got a goal. We really kind of battled back, got a uh, penalty kick, uh, you know, with about five minutes to go. And at that point, you think, OK, maybe we can go get the winner. Um, if nothing else, we're going to take a draw, which would have been a good draw against a good Aggies team, and uh, gave up a set piece goal with about three minutes to go. Very uncharacteristic of our team. Um, to give up that kind of goal that late. So disappointed in the loss, but we got to shift gears now to, you know, one of the biggest games of the year, if not our biggest game of the year, against uh, Mississippi State on Thursday night, 6 o'clock at home. Um, they are, uh, we got a very good RPI. They're ranked nationally. Uh, a very good team. James is doing a great job down there. A lot of respect for those guys. But they're a physical, tough team. Um, that we got to be ready for a, a you know, really tough match. We get to play for a trophy, uh, the Magnolia Cup, as we call it in soccer. Um, that's, that's been down there for the last couple seasons. Um, so certainly very motivated um, to, to kick off against uh, Mississippi State again, 6 o'clock uh, Thursday night, hoping for a big crowd. Rebel Nation's been great. We're our team. Our crowds have been fantastic, whether it's been Sunday afternoon or Thursday night. We really appreciate that, and um, we need them certainly one more time here against uh, against the Bulldogs. Any questions? Uh, over this three-game stretch, from your what have you seen maybe that that maybe isn't clicking? That was through that first half plus of the season for y'all. Yeah, one you know, Bama is having you know they're third in the country. They're they're rolling, and uh, we went into a. Um, a difficult environment there and again tried to change some tactics and just didn't work. Um, Tennessee, I thought we fought hard. Um, again, good team. They're leading the East, um, you know, and just didn't create enough offense. And then yesterday it was, it was that. I thought we were good in spells, but offensively just not creating enough. You know, get the, the goal to tie it off the penalty kick. Um, I thought defended well, but and we, we need to create more goal scoring chances and, and we're not and I don't think we're getting the ball in good spots. We're panicking a little bit with the ball. Uh, we just got to be better with it, right? I mean, I think when you look at seasons, they kind of yo-yo and we're in that, that low spot right now. We got to dig ourselves back out. Anything else? Okay, thanks guys.